Hey guys, Kat here, and today we have a quick 10 minute cardio workout. So each exercise will be 50 seconds on with 10 seconds rest. During those 10 seconds, I'll have a little preview box so you can see exactly what the next movement is. So remember to go at your own pace. If you need a little bit of extra time for a break, then make sure you take it. This is your workout for you. And yeah, we're gonna get a quick wor uh, warm up and quick workout as well. And <laughs> to make sure we prevent injury and to also get those muscles and that heart ready. So let's get started. <laughs> All right guys, let's get started bouncing it out, getting loose in the shoulders, so a little crisscross here. Remember to relax the traps. We don't need to tense them up. We hold enough stress there already. Three, two, one, and feet a little bit wider than hip width, and we're gonna bring it around time, just like SpongeBob. Think about pushing that booty back, woo, and keeping a nice flat back. And then go ahead and go the other way. Nice rotations. Three, two, and then one more. Nice job. All right, go ahead. We got jumping jacks. Remember, you can always tap it out to the side if you need to. Bring those feet out wide. No dinosaur arms here. Touching the hands at the top. Nice job, guys. Get that breath ready and that heart rate coming up. Three, two, one, nice job. All right, from here, we're gonna go with alternating back lunge, but you're gonna bring it around at the top. So sink down and then open up that hip. Sink it and open, sink it and open. Nice job, guys. Again, real quick warm up. That's super, super important to do. Let's go one more. And nice job, all right. Shaky, shaky, some high knees. Start dragging it up. Try to be light on the toes to protect your joints. Three, two, and one. Nice job, shaky, shaky. All right, some squats. Toes facing out slightly, push that booty back. Keep that chest up. Try to get at least 90 degrees here with those legs. We're almost done warming up. Nice job. Let's go two more. Last one. And go ahead, shake it out. Let's get some lateral movement in. So we're just gonna go with some skaters. So step to the side, bring the other leg behind you. If you want a little bit more of a challenge, you can touch that ground. Just make sure you bring your chest up in between. Whew. Nice job. Yeah, the heart rate's coming up just a little bit. <laughs> Let's go three more. Last two. One more. And go ahead. Shaky, shaky. One more, guys. So, arms out, steel jacks. Jumping jacks, except we're really getting those shoulders laterally, giving the air a hug. Keep going. Let's go for five, four, three, two, one, and let's get started. Okay, guys, 10 seconds. We're going to take an element from that warm up and do a skater with a hop. So remember, you can touch the ground to make it. Harder, if you want to. All right, let's go. Skate and hop up. Really think about bringing your chest up first so that way you're not here and then just jumping up, okay? That's gonna help you keep straight. And up. Bring that foot up behind the other leg. Ooh, struggled with saying that. <laughs> And up. So this is awesome because we're also getting some great stability here. Side and up. Keep going. 10 seconds. And up. Last five, four, three, two, and done. Okay, this is where it gets a little harder. <laughs> three switch lunges with a front kick. Switch lunges are always a beast. If you need to walk them out, go for it or stick with the preview. Okay, so one, two, three, front kick, bring it back. 
Make sure you sink down all the way. One, two, three, and kick. One, two, three, and kick. Keep it going, guys. I know those legs, they're gonna start to feel it, a lot of it. You're welcome. One, two, three, finish it out. 10 seconds, and kick. Woo. Three, two, and one. Okay, so combining two really fun movements, two squat jumps, four ankle taps. Ankle taps are harder, coordination-wise. So take your time, one, two, one, two, three, four. Keep that chest up. One, two, four. Remember, you can always do high knees instead. One, two, four. Keep going, guys. Two. Whew. We're over halfway. One, two, four. Yeah, my heart rate's up. I love it. So many different ways we can move our bodies. Two, three, two, one, four grasshoppers, or sorry, three grasshoppers for dancing crunch. So with this one, really think about bringing your foot to the outside of that hand, plant your entire foot too. So one, two, three, drive it in. One, two, three, if you want a little bit more stability work, Bring that leg and foot, sorry, hand and foot up. And crunch. Nice little core work. One, two, three, whoops. One, two, three. Keep going, guys. Those legs are gonna feel it. If your legs aren't feeling it, how? <laughs> One, two, three, crunch. Okay, so some moves are forever. That was one of them. Okay, so this next one, start with your feet together. That's gonna help you get the movement down. So one, two, three, jump to the side. Keep your chest up. If you can't, Keep your back flat. When you touch the ground, don't sink down as low. Whew. Whew. One, two, three. Whew. Oh, goodness. <laughs> two, three. We're already gonna be halfway. So stay with me, guys. Whew. See, just because it's a shorter workout doesn't mean it's not effective. So next time you only have 10 minutes, think of this workout. Oh, okay, broad jump. So that means we're jumping far with 10 high knees. If you don't have room, just jump up like squat jump. Okay, so all the way, two, five, six, five, and 10, and turn. All the way, one, whoops. Land as soft as you can. I know when you get tired, it's harder. Keep going. Oh my goodness. Seven, eight, ten. Finish it out. Balance crunch. Okay. Whew. Let's do it. Switch, balance, crunch. Whew. 
switch. If you want to make it harder, bring it to the side and crunch. Switch over, crunch. Get it back up. Switch over and crunch. Keep rocking it, guys. And back. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Keep going. 15 seconds. Woo. There she goes. Okay. Last time. Switch over. Crunch. Stabilize. Three, two, and one. That's a lot. <laughs> Snap kicks. You feel like you're in the matrix in this next one. If you need to walk it out, you can. Okay? Kick and switch. Try to alternate, but if you can't, then I'll tell you when we're halfway. You can switch. And kick. Just think about with the leg that you kick with, then the next one you're gonna just drive the knee up. Halfway and switch. <laughs> Almost there, guys. Ten seconds. Hiya. Airborne. Three, two, and one. Okay. So, single leg burpee, three pogo hops. If you can't do single leg burpee, just do a regular. If you need to walk it out, that's okay too. Okay, I'm gonna start on my. Right foot, all the way down, up, jump, one, two, three, and switch. You don't have to do chest to floor. If you want to, walk, 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 calf raise. Okay, three times. Totally cool if you're feeling it. Up and up. Down and up, two, three, and switch. Whew. Almost there, guys. Switch. We're on our last move after this. Okay, so you can stay down here actually if you're down here. Plank to squat. So you want to think about making sure. You bring your chest out before you add the squat in to protect that lower back, okay? So, jump up, come up, squat, down, back. Some of you are like, Kat, that's a burpee. And to that I say, no. <laughs> I would never trick you like that. <laughs> Take your time in this movement. Some of you are gonna wanna crank out reps and rush. Don't do that. Get the form down. Okay. Keep going. We're gonna cool down after this. Shaky, shaky. Squat. Down, up. Okay, my dudes. Yes. We are cooling it down. You can always repeat this workout if you want to make it longer. That's what she said. And we are going to go ahead and stretch. So super important to prevent injury. Take advantage of our warm bodies being warm so we can get the most out of stretching. So come on down. Starting with crisscross applesauce. Whew, nice tall spine. Get that breath back to normal. From here, we're going to take that right hand to the left knee, left hand back, inhale tall, exhale twist, turn, look over that left shoulder. Slowly bring it back, shaky, shaky, <laughs> and left to right knee, inhale tall, exhale twist and turn, breathe. After this, we'll get the legs, because they did a lot. And go ahead, slowly release. Shaky, shaky. So flip it over onto the knees. We're gonna come into that runner's lunge. So we're gonna bring our right leg forward, press 
into it. She feels in the left hip flexor. Breathe. You can pulse it out if you want to. And then hands down to the ground. We're gonna press back. And then think about bringing your right hip in. So that way we are a little bit straighter with those hips. So now we're getting the calves and the hamstrings. You can go ahead and pulse that foot if you want to. And then go ahead and switch. Whew. So great job showing up today because some days it's hard when you're like, I don't have a lot of time. Or maybe you're stacking this, that's cool too. Hands onto the floor, press back, breathe. Just remember you did everything awesome today. <laughs> Good job. And go ahead and bring it back. And from here, if this is comfortable to sit like this, you can, or you come to the knees or stand. We're gonna get the neck because we hold a lot of stress here. And go ahead, relax your neck entirely. Right hand on the left side and pull. And sometimes in our movements, we tense up those traps. So we wanna make sure this is nice and stretched. Slowly release, side to side. Other side. And then after this, we're gonna head into a mini meditation if you can stick around. If you can't, please do like the video and comment below. Let me know which movement was really fun for you. And go ahead side to side. Or just leave a cake or pie emoji because I love cake and pie. So come on down. You can lay down if you want to. I'm gonna lay down today. That sounds really nice. And go ahead, palms up. Nice deep breaths here, and I'm gonna guide you. So take this time for yourself if you can. So wonderful. Nice deep breaths. So right now, I really want you guys to just concentrate on that beating heart that's probably still going a little bananas. With these movements today, we were working so hard to strengthen them, to strengthen our heart. And it is the thing that keeps us alive and doing the things that we love. So right now, let's put our hands right by our heart or on that heart. Feel it. And let's send a little bit of gratitude to it for taking us through this workout through our lives and through our future. Go ahead, take one more big inhale. Exhale. Thank you, heart. Go ahead, drop the arms by your side. Slowly roll over onto your right side, left hand on the ground. Let's press ourselves up to a seated position. Yay, we did it! <laughs> awesome job, you guys. Thank you so much for joining me for this quick workout. I'm gonna go up to the camera now. Thank you guys so much for joining me for this quick workout. Hopefully you loved it. Please let me know in the comments below how it went for you. And please also like the video. Both of those things really help out my channel. It helps people see it more. And YouTube's like, ooh, let's show this chick more. And I'm like, tweet, tweet. Anyway, um, I hope you guys have an amazing rest of the day. Keep taking care of your body and sending that heart some love and gratitude. And yeah, I will see you soon. Do all the things. And if you want to support my channel, there is a link in my description that says support my channel. Anything and everything is greatly appreciated. So kick all the booty, sparkle on. Oh my God, we can sparkle. Clasp the hands in front, pull the shoulders in. Big inhale up, exhale. Oh, sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. Almost forgot there. All right, guys, keep sparkling on. Rawr.